So I'm going to switch over and talk about Tucker and Kane. Tucker and Kane, where they came, Tucker, just to remind you, because in case you weren't listening before, if you knew, Tucker is the uh, former Army Ranger, Captain Tucker Wayne, and his military war dog, Kane. I discovered that team basically when I was uh, at a USO tour about a year and a half ago to Iraq and Kuwait. Um, it's great meeting the men and women out there in the field, uh, the wonderful bunch of people. But of course, I'm a veterinarian, so the first thing I think is dogs. <laughs> And so I thought I'm going to you know, find out exactly how they are using these dogs. Are they, just, are they just guard dogs? What are they using these dogs for? How versatile are they? Who, how, you know, how, what is the relationship between the hand dog handler and that dog? Do they just treat that dog as a military hardware? Is that dog just a sidearm to this person? What is their relationship like? And I found actually it's a very intimate relationship. Uh, the handlers are bonded very deeply. They're attached, basically one dog, one guy. As long as this guy's in service or this dog's in service, they stay together. Uh, they eat together, sleep together, train together. One guy said that, you know, this dog understands me better than my wife does. So I knew there was something there. And there's, there's a phrase they commonly use, it's called it runs down the lead, describing how the emotions between dog and handler uh, merge over time, that travels up and down that leash, binding them together. And I was really fascinated by that, and I just, you know, how intimately they're tied to the, their whole ceremony if a dog dies, it's very, very engrossing. I thought there's some way I want to try to capture that bond and put it in the book. So I took one step further because again I am a veterinarian so I'm never going to leave it good enough alone. I thought I'm going to write from the dog's perspective. <laughs> so there are some scenes in this book that are actually from the dog from Kane's POV. And it's what made me fall in love with Kane. Hopefully you guys will too because Kane is a, it was so much fun to write. I didn't want to create a human you know, I didn't want to create a soldier with four legs. I wanted to create, you know, what was it to really experience the world as a dog? So I did, again, my veterinary background, also doing some research about, uh, you know, how dogs perceive the world, what the emotional world of the dog is. I try to capture that all, you know, to hopefully to put readers into the paws of that dog so they can experience, you know, how, what it's like to protect, to hunt, to fight alongside somebody else. And, you know, hopefully, at least the positive feedback I've gotten so far seems to be pretty good about that character. So hopefully you guys will like him too. I, I love him. So that's Tucker, and that's the origin Tucker and Kane.